Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Well, it's back to winter, and it's going to stay that way for some time. We'll see mostly clear skies this evening. Temperatures coming down very quickly. 15 degrees at 7, 12 degrees at 9 p.m. Maybe a few more clouds returning from the west at 11 o'clock, around 11 degrees. And then just a slow drop off from there with partly cloudy skies. 6 degrees at 8 o'clock in the morning. Maybe getting back toward mostly clear conditions briefly in the morning. And then partly cloudy skies at noon should be mostly cloudy at 5 o'clock with a temperature around 24. Still looking at winds around 15 miles per hour. Hour here out of the north and northwest, keeping those wind chill numbers uh, down to the single digit values for us. And we could even see those readings go a little bit below uh, the zero degree mark this evening. And a beautiful sunset tonight as the clouds continue to thin out across the region, getting back to those mostly clear skies. A little thicker band of clouds back west of us in Indiana, and that may drift eastward again later tonight. Lows tonight should hit the low to mid or uh, down into the single digits, and then highs tomorrow up in the low to mid 20s. And then on Valentine's Day, look what's going to happen. Arctic air comes blowing in and we'll reach our high in the morning around 23 degrees but then snow showers and falling temperatures after that as more frigid air finds its way into the region. Tonight we're looking at dry weather over us. There's that plume of moisture off of Lake Michigan. Snow showers down through Kokomo, Carmel, Indiana and down to uh, Indianapolis and east of there. Maybe clipping some of the western portions of Wayne County, Indiana in our viewing area but this band of snow will stay west of us this evening but still expecting it to weaken and maybe a few of those clouds drifting back into the area tonight. Next system coming into the northern plain states. Swing some cloud cover down our way later in the day tomorrow. We had a high today of 32. Low temperatures so far 20, but we'll continue to drop off an eight tenths of an inch of snow at Dayton International Airport. Right now, clear to partly cloudy skies, 19 degrees. That's our low for the day now. A north northwest wind at 15 with a wind chill factor at 5. And Springfield already down to 15 degrees tonight with a wind out of the northwest at 12 miles an hour, giving a wind chill factor of 2. Our weather checkers up north, Lowell Miller and Greenville down to 18 degrees. Don Chateau and Sydney at 17 degrees. Getting into the upper teens, Scott Biesick are there in Bradford and low 20s across the southern part of our region. Uh, Jim Allen and Springboro in the low 20s tonight. Future track forecast, even though we'll be mostly clear uh, for a good part of the evening, we will see a few of those clouds come back in, as I mentioned there. Uh, partly sunny day generally tomorrow, but then those clouds increasing just a tad again tomorrow afternoon. There's even a slight chance we could see a couple of flakes of snow fall out of those clouds into the evening, but our next real chance of snow coming up on Saturday. Forecast tonight, partly cloudy, very cold. Northwest winds will drop off to 5 to 10. We'll head down to 6 degrees, and then clouds increasing tomorrow afternoon. We'll call it a partly sunny day, though, all in all. 25 for that afternoon high. 14 degrees at 10 o'clock, 19 degrees at noon, and then up into the low to mid-20s tomorrow afternoon and into the evening with that slight chance of flurry. Saturday, a more Morning low of 20 with a morning high of 23 and then falling temperatures into the teens with a good chance of some snow. And then look at those frigid conditions Sunday. Morning low of zero with a high of 12. A chance again of some snow late day Monday and into Tuesday. Not much sign of any warmth there over the next seven.